this is how what I'm doing in my IP today. I'm going to make some IP pizzas. All right, I got a, I got a ham and cheese right here with a little bit of spinach on it. I use corn tortillas, okay? I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to do my crust. I ain't figured out if I'm going to brown it yet when I get done. We're going to wait and see how it does, but I can always get my torch out. All right, I got a pepperoni right here. All right. And I got a chicken alfredo right here. So I'm going to stack all three of them, okay? Now, I'm gonna, we're going to put a cup of water in my... When I stack three of these tubes, y'all, I need, I need eight quart, okay? Anyway, we're going to stack that bad boy right up there like that. Just like that. And I'm going to do it manual. Man, four minutes. Four minutes, and we'll be back. All right, y'all, they're done. What I'm doing now is I heated this ham and cheese of the torch. It's pretty good, don't it? All right, and I sent the other two. I got the other two in my dry uh, air fryer. All right, five minutes. Let's see what it looks like. All right. Let me unstack those things right quick, and we'll see what they all look like. Be right back. All right, y'all, here they are. I had to put these two in the air fryer. I torched this one, okay? This is this is ham and cheese, okay, with spinach in it. This is chicken alfredo, all right, and this is pepperoni, all right? I'm going to let these cool just a minute, and we're going to slide these off, and I'm going to slice them, all right? Anyway, the air fryer, five minutes, okay? Let's run through it again in case I messed up my first video. I'm going to try to merge it together, but anyway... I used corn tortillas, all right, and then I just put my, my tomato sauce and, and, and layered it and put another, uh, just kept layering it all the way up, all three of them, all right. And then I put it in pressure cooker for four minutes and then I did a two minute natural pressure release. All right, I stacked them. I done all three of them at one time. All right, I'll be right back in a minute. We're gonna let these cool just a second. All right, y'all check this out. I'm uh, got them all done now, I'm just, Taking my little tool right here and slicing them up. Okay, slide right down in the pan. All right, now that gets it most of the time all the way, but we're gonna see what this thing looks like. All right, let me slide this bad boy off right here. All right, there's one of them. There's one of them. All right, that's pepperoni. Pepperoni. All right, here's a chicken alfredo. Let's do that. Slide right off. All right. Do one more. Let's see what this looks like. This, this is ham and cheese, y'all. Hey, this is, uh, uh, that come pop right off. That was pretty good. I did put wax paper under that, y'all, but I don't think I really needed it. Anyway, I'm fixing to slide one of these out. I'm going to show y'all what it looks like. Okay, let's see if I can get this bad boy out right here. Okay, here we go. Let me, let me get that cheese and kind of mend it back together. Alright, here we go. Every one of them. Alright. Now, I'm gonna have to have a big piece of this pepperoni. What y'all think? Alright. I'm gonna have a big piece of that. Alright, let's do that one downtown, that side right there. Let's get that. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Alright. There's that. Now, chicken alfredo. Chicken alfredo. Get that a little bit right there. All right, all three of them, one time. Four minutes, two minutes, natural pressure relief. Okay, all right. Y'all know what I'm gonna have to do right now then. All right, here we go. One little, little bite and we gotta go. All right. That's it.